What is going on everybody? David here and today I got a brand new video for y'all and this time it is another eBay purchase video. So happy to finally get this piece. Hopefully that it's not damaged or anything or no broken pieces because if there is I'll be really pissed off. Uh, I say that because you know it kind of shook around a little bit and it tells me one thing the seller didn't really pack the items um, the way it should be. So we will be taking a look at that when I open up the uh, the box here in a second. But uh, like I said, I'm so excited to have this piece. Um, I hope I'm not disappointed with it because, um, like I said, I just hope it's in one piece and everything's there and nothing's broken. <laughs> because, ah! Uh, um, but anyways, uh, the purpose of this, I, I was inspired by a fellow YouTuber and good friend, um, of uh, Louis Collectibles, and um, he had purchased a particular item there. And if you have not checked out his channel, I highly recommend you doing it. So, because great content, great guy overall. I've done uh, several trades uh, with him and stuff. So, um, great person, and um, <clears throat> he does uh, reviews and hauls. Uh, he does collect vintage and modern uh, figures. So. If you like that kind of stuff, go check him out. But anyways, um, there's a particular item that he had purchased and I was really inspired by. It and I was like, you know what? I, I need to quit playing around and see if I can get a good deal too. So, and I did. So, uh, his came with a box. Mine didn't. And that's okay. Um, the boxes come and go and stuff like that. So uh, I might later on down the road, if there's a, a box for sale, then I'll probably uh, pick it up if it's for a reasonable price. But anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and crack this box open. All right. Well, I, I have to say um, it is a little wrapped up, but not much. As you can see, there's a lot of wriggle, wiggle room. So uh, as you can tell, is why I was a little on the fence about it and a little nervous because there was no padding around it, especially for an item like this that's uh, difficult to find complete and um, that's 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 not cheap. <laughs> Fortunately, I was able to get this pretty cheap, you know. And uh, <clears throat> so, but anyways, uh, as you can tell, if 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 you know your vintage stuff. Uh, this is a, a, a toy biz item, and um, so let's go ahead and see, tell that he, all he did was just wrap it up, you know, uh, a valid attempt, but still, there's gaps and stuff where, you know. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and take this stuff out and further inspect everything. All right, so I was just able to get everything out in just one swoop, you know. This is how he had wrapped it up. You know, I don't I don't like doing stuff like this because of the fact that, you know, I just need to show people how sometimes certain people or sellers, how they take care of their products and, and ship it out to the, the customer and stuff. Um, I, I appreciate the fact that he uh, included the pieces in here and everything. So let's hope that it's not broken or anything like that. As you can tell, y'all, most of y'all probably already know what this is already. And then uh, this is the other half right here. This is the front part and this is the back part. So let's go ahead and unwrap all this stuff. So, uh, but I'm glad he did put it in the bubble wrap. Uh, not really knocking it too hard, but it could have been a little bit better. So yeah. And we have the Toy Biz X-Men Blackbird Jet playset i am so happy that everything <clears throat> excuse me <clears throat> mm. uh, allergies <laughs> but um anyways like i said i am so happy to finally have this piece in my collection it is a cornerstone of every person's collection that has or collects um toy biz x-men and I for one of them, so I am very happy to finally add this cornerstone piece to the collection because this is a very essential part of the uh, collection. 
And if you have Toy Biz, if you don't have this thing, you need to get yourself one. Buy it, you can buy it cheap. You can buy it in pieces and parts, you know, and put it together with piece by piece. Um, you know, just whatever you got to do. But um, this is a, an amazing piece. And um, the only knock that I have is that it uh, the stickers are at the bottom <laughs> of the wings. Um, the, I could probably see if I could take that off, but I probably really don't want to. So that way I could just put it right there, you know, but Hey, it looks good either way, you know, um, but everything's there, you know, it's got the two missiles and that's one of the main things that, um, you will see when you find a lot of these loose on sale, they don't come with the missiles. So, and, um, it's just one of those unfortunate things. And some of these missiles, these two missiles, let alone go for at least 15 to 20 bucks a piece, you know, You'd probably get you a set of these missiles for at least about $40. It's crazy. I know, but that's just the, the, the premium price for these, for those missiles single handedly or together, you know, but anyways, uh, but yeah, I will be doing a review of this thing later on down the line. I just wanted to get this out to let y'all know uh, that I was able to finally get one of these things. And uh, this will be going on to my Toy Biz shelf with my X-Men. I'm doing some rearranging and I'm hoping to add another shelf so that way it can be dedicated just for my Toy Biz alone. So I'm looking forward to that. But anyways, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video as much as I did filming it. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this thing. And if you had one or if you still have yours uh, from your childhood. And um, yeah, let me, let me know what you think. You know, will you be adding this to your collection? Do you want this in your collection? Uh, let me know. Talk to me. Where's the wisdom? Buy what you love and not what you like. Because if you buy what you like, you will always end up getting rid of it. And I will catch y'all later.